hey welcome to let's play guitar today we are checking out how to play chandelier by Sia such a powerful song this is and it uses a capo on the first fret to match it with the original track but I'm gonna show you without any capo because um, it doesn't really make a difference and if you're a beginner then this song is not too difficult because we are using only three or four chords for the entire song right so the strum patterns uh, we're gonna make some new strum patterns for this one and make the song sound uh, very powerful um, as much as we can on the acoustic guitar so let's get into it let's see how to play the first verse it goes something like this we're using A minor over here we're using an F major we're using G and we're using E minor all right so it goes something like this Body goes, don't get up, can't feel anything. We lie down, I push it down, push it down. I'm the one for the time call. My doorbell, I feel in love, fell in love. Okay, and then you go to the pre chorus of the song one, two, three, one, two, three, ring, those lines. So the strumming pattern, it might look a, look a little bit complicated. But what I'm actually doing is I'm using palm muting. So you put your palm just where the strings begin, right over here, just where the strings begin, and then you strum. So when you down strum, when you do the down, um, you're gonna use palm muting because um, you're using a pure palm which is kept on over the strings. But when you do the up stroke, you know you raise your palm over there. So you don't really have the palm muting then because when you do up, you raise your palm. So that way you get this unique sound, like a beat, and it sounds really nice. So you can get like, you know? So when I'm, when I'm doing down, I'm doing palm muting. When I go up, my palm is raised, so it doesn't involve palm muting over there. So the string pattern is. It is down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. So you can break it down, you get down, down, up, down, then again, down, down, up, down, and then down, down, up. So if you see, I'm using these strings for the A minor, all right? Uh, you don't really have to go to the first string yet, so down, down, up, down, again, down, down, up, down, and then down, down, up. So you just do it once, and then you move to F chord. I'm playing it this way. Um, you can use your easy F, F uh, major 7 if you want. First fret, second fret, third fret, and this one open. Um, but you're going to use a proper F if you can and play a proper F chord. So you do the same strumming pattern over there. Down, down, up, down. Down, down, up, down. Down, down, up. And then change the chord to G major. Now here I'm using this one, the G with our third note on the B string. Do the same thing, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Okay, once more slowly. So if you can see, like I said before, when I'm doing the upstroke, you can hear um, the, the string ringing clearly. Then you want to go to E minor, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Okay, so that's what you have for the verses. Down, down, up, down, down down up down 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 up F G E minor one more time I'm the one for a good time call down down up down 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 up down down I feel love feel love down down up down 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 up down down okay down down up down 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 up down and then you go to your precursor of the song the precursor sounds something like this one, two, three, one, two, three, drink. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. One, two, three, one, two, three, drink. Throw them back to I lose count. So, what you want to do is keep the same streaming pattern and use palm muting um, still on the first pre chorus. You got down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down. A minor, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down. G chord, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down. And then you do the G chord again, but now you keep the B string open. So this is our conventional G chord. 
and strum it once. Throw them back to the last count and then you go to the chorus. So once again the pre-chorus, one, two, three, one, two, three, break. One, two, three, one, two, three, break. Down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, and G. To the last count. Now you go to the chorus of the song, which goes something like this. Gonna swing from the And then you change the strumming pattern, which I will come to later. First, you gotta learn this one. For this one, what we're doing is down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, so you can break it down actually. You go down, up, down, up, down. That's the first part. And then up, down, up, down is the second part. Go to the G chord. So down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Go to G, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Go to C major, chandelier. Go to F major, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Do it one more time. Gonna live like F major, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. And then you can actually change the strumming pattern. Or you can change the swing pattern after uh, you go to the next um, part of the chorus. So you can keep doing this. So now the strumming pattern goes something like this. So here you go, and I'm holding on for my life. Warm and down, open my eyes. Keep my glass warm and turn my mind. Because I'm just holding on for tonight. Okay, so here you change the strumming pattern, and here you're doing down, down, up, down, up, down, down. Okay, this is a simpler version. So you can actually use this for the entire chorus if you wish. So down, down, up, down, up, down. The G chord. Now I like to play it just two frets up like this. Bar chord. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down. Move to C chord. So you can play C like this, the bar chord version. Okay. So C chord. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down. Move to F again. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down. So I'm holding on for my life. G. F, F, F again, G, open my eyes, C chord, F chord again, then you can do F again, on for tonight, and then you go to the second verse, so after the first chorus you go to the second verse, you go to the second pre-chorus, and then you go to the second chorus again, the whole thing. thing and then the, the second part of the chorus as well down down up down up down down and G C chord the whole thing one more time on for tonight and in the very end you just go on for tonight and then on for tonight you know? in the end you can actually play all the chords just once because I'm just holding on for tonight on for tonight, on for tonight, you know, simple F, strum it once, then strum G chord, on for tonight, on for tonight, on for tonight, and you end the song with the F chord, alright, so pretty basic, so I hope you liked this lesson, if you did like it, then make sure to hit that thumbs up button, I really appreciate all of your support, and now I'm going to show you how to play some of the lead part that I was doing, especially in the chorus. So we're going to check that out. It goes something like this. So you're on the fifth fret of third string, where you can slide down, slide up to the fifth fret. 
You hit the second fret on the same string, third string, fifth fret, and then the fourth fret. And then second fret and then open. So you get and then you go second fret on the fourth string, third fret, fifth fret on um, the fourth string, and then fifth fret on third string. So you can have a little bar over here. So you get and then hit the second fret on third string three times. Hit the fourth fret, hit the fifth fret, hit the sixth fret on the B string. So then do the whole thing one more time. So here you can do something like this, you know, do a little pull off from the 4th fret to the 2nd fret on 3rd string, then the open, and then the rest is the same, so, and then, and then the next part is, So, 5th fret on 3rd string, 7th fret on 4th string, 5th fret on 3rd string, slide from 5th to the 7th fret. So, alright, and then, so, do the 7th fret and do the 5th fret on 3rd string. Slide from 7 to 9, slide back from 7 to 5 and play the 5th fret again. And then, so, twice on 5th fret of the 4th string, ninth fret on 3rd string, hammer on from 7th fret to the ninth fret and back to 7th fret. Similarly, do the same thing on the 5th to 7th fret, so, so you get, and then, and then do the whole thing that we did before. Yeah, that is it for this whole song. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Give this video a like if I helped you. And make sure you comment down below as well. I love reading all your comments and responding to them. And I will talk to you guys next time. Till then, goodbye.